Da, 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 da. I don't want a lot for Christmas. There is just one thing I need. And I, I, Christmas tree. I just want you for my own. More than you could ever know. Make my dreams come true. All I want for Christmas. Hey, oh, didn't I'm mean, sorry. Didn't mean what, to startle you there. That's okay. What you got there? Actually, I made my famous hot chocolate for, for you and for okay. me. Famous? Yes. Who? Says who? Says who? Come, Come on, on. Taste Come it. On. You're going to know. No, I can't wait to try oh, it. Wait, 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 wait. Um, before you try it, hello. Yeah. Hot chocolate. You have to Ooh, have marshmallows, good call. right? Good looking out. Good looking good out, out for me. Thank you. Thank Let's open it up. Here, let me just. Okay, here we go. Okay. All righty. All right. All right. Okay, hold your cup, hold your cup. Okay, this is right. yours, this okay. is mine. Fair enough. Okay, you just Getting tell me what. Okay, okay, perfect, perfect. Oh. Well, let's, let's okay. live generously oh. here. Okay. Come on. A little bit more? Uh, even more. Okay. Oh, don't scamp on me. Let's oh. go. Still? More, please. More, oh. please. Oh. Oh. oh, Keep coming. Okay. Keep it coming. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good. Wait, wait, Keep wait. Going. Keep going. Keep yeah, going. Yeah, sure. yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I need more mallows, please. More mallows. Really? More that, mallows. That's pretty much, mm, that's, that's more looking. More mallows. I see more in the bag. Uh, okay, I can... well, I kind of wanted some. Well, you can have a few. Oh, wow. Mm. That's literally That's all of them. Perfect. Um, let's start the Elkage show. Yeah, now I don't get mm. any. Right. That's okay. We can have a couple here. <laughs> Why, hello there, hello. and tidings of good cheer. My name is Pastor Evil. Oh, yeah, and my name is Pastor Taylor, and welcome to the Elk Kids Show. We are so excited, guys, to have you join us for the best time of year. Christmas! It's, Christ it's Christmas! It's Christmas! It's Christmas! Wait, Christmas. is that a gift? Is that a uh, gift for me? You yeah. shouldn't have. You shouldn't have. Okay, well, technically, this is a gift for all of us. Okay. And it is going to help us tell one of the most important stories ever told. Ooh, so can we open it? Okay, how about you open it because I wrapped it oh. and it's actually a lot of fun to watch people I, open gifts. I, I won't say no to that. Come I won't on, say no on. to that. All right, let's check it out. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. No way. Is this what I think it is? Yeah. Oh. Open it up. Yes! Dude, dude, it's our storybook for our series, How Jesus Saved the World. This is so awesome. Yeah, I know, right? This book is going to guide us through God's word of why we celebrate Christmas yes. and what it's all about. Yeah, you know, people get pretty mixed up with the true meaning of Christmas. Yeah, like, they do. You know, with the lights and the gifts, mm -hmm. the trees, the cookies. Yeah. Did I mention gifts? Uh, yeah, yeah, you did. Yeah. And it's okay. very true. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love all things Christmas yes. and there's nothing wrong with having fun and For celebrating. Sure. Yeah. But we should never lose sight of why we celebrate. Uh, you know, and you know what a good reminder of that is? Mm. Our Bible verse. Mm. Yeah. So let's call out our little brosaurus, mm. Ty, together and see what he's got for us today. Great idea. Yeah. Okay, everyone, let's call him out with a big shout of O Ty on the count of three. Ooh. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three. O Ty! Come on come out. On. Hey! He's self decorated for Christmas. You got a little hat. You're so cute. And he brought us a gift. Mm. Oh, oh, our thank Bible you, verse, sir. which is thank God's you. word. Merry Man. Christmas, Ty. You're it so cute. Really hits different you, this time of year. I think you could have. Uh, Proud of him. Give him Ty. a little, one yeah, little marshmallow. There you go. Okay, open okay, up, oh, fella. Oh, oh. A little marshmallow for wow. you before you go. Thank you. Yeah. You're so amazing. Oh my gosh. And there he goes. Just Just mystery. Like gone. He's gone. He's gone he does it. Like oh my gosh. Course. So let's read our verse, which is a gift, God's gift to us. Yeah. It's the Bible. And our verse is found in 1 John 4:14. 4, so if you have yes. a Bible, open, open it, up. it up. Open it up. Get it open. I'm gonna read it. Okay. Okay. And we have seen and testify that the Father has sent his Son to be the Savior of the world. Ain't that true? That's a good one. That's well, a great one. Okay, but you know what? I read it, but I think that, you know. As is tradition, as right? As is tradition, right? sir. Gotta repeat the verse. We have to repeat the verse, and, and yeah. the kids, you guys could join us, okay? okay? I wanna hear you guys get loud, all right? Be proud, because this is how you're gonna memorize God's word. Mm -hmm. Just hearing it from us, it's not enough. You gotta say it too. That's so, right. you guys mm -hmm. ready? Okay, here we go. go. Here we go. And we have seen and testify that the Father has sent his Son 
to be the savior of the world. Of the world. Yes. Way yes. To and remember, go. 1 John 4 14. Yes, this verse is the heart of Christmas and yeah. why we celebrate. God sent us a savior, his son. Jesus. That's right. That's right. He sent him to fulfill God's plan, and that plan Ooh. was to save the world. But Ooh. I think we need a better understanding of why we needed to be saved. Uh, I could not agree more. Hand me that book. To you, madame. Yes. Let's hand it over to our good friend Fabian for some uh, story time. Great idea. Oh, thanks, guys. Man, I just love Christmas stories. I It's my favorite time of the year. And really, we get to read about how Jesus saved the world. But before we get into our story, let's drink some hot cocoa, because why not? Oh man, that's so toasty, so good. So today, what are we reading, you might ask? We are reading that God has a plan. Now, Let's go ahead and dive right on in. So we're gonna go ahead and start off in the book of Isaiah in chapter seven. We read the prophet Isaiah giving a message from God to the king of Judah at the time. King Ahaz, 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 Ahaz. We'll, we'll go with Ahaz for right now. I think that's fine. Ahaz was afraid that Syria and Israel would join up to wipe the people of Judah off the earth. But God delivered this message to him through Isaiah in verse 14. It says, all right then, the Lord himself will give you a sign. Look, the virgin will conceive a child and she will give birth to a son and will name him Emmanuel, which means God is with us. See, this is super crazy because long before the birth of Jesus, this was 700 years that this was prophesied. God didn't just decide one day to go ahead and send Jesus. It was planned all along. God promised his people that a king would one day be born from the line of King David, the same David that killed Goliath and ruled right after King Saul. We're gonna continue our story, but let's get a drink of our hot cocoa one more time. Oh man, so good, so good. The prophet Micah foretold that Jesus, the savior of the world, would be born in a tiny, tiny little town named Bethlehem. He would be the one who would be the source of all wisdom and connect an unworthy mankind to an amazing God. Jesus was going to save not only God's chosen people, but his grace, life, and wisdom would extend across the entire world. He would give us a path to God our Father and provide salvation for us for our own sin and evil. But this Savior wasn't some knight, wasn't some warrior. He was born a small, fragile baby. This Savior would ultimately give his life for all of us, dying on the cross for our sins and being raised from the grave three days later. This was the plan all along and it shows that God loved his people so much that he was willing to give his only son for us. Wow, wasn't that just so amazing? I love Christmas stories and I love sharing the greatest Christmas story of all time. Well, L kids, I'll see you guys next time. A Savior is Born by Faith Rider. O infant Jesus, son of our Lord, who spread special love and is widely adored. You brightened the world on the day of your birth and many years later saved people on earth. Many people had seen and followed the star. They came from all over, some traveled afar. All came to praise you, the young and the old. Some came with gifts like frankincense and gold. All those who looked in the manger and saw the little Lord Jesus were filled with great awe. Young Mary gave birth to God's only son, and Joseph raised him as God would have done. As he lay sleeping on his small bed of hay, the people all rejoiced, he has come, praise the day. The shepherds, the angels, and the wise men of three all came to gaze on the Savior that was and is to be. No one who came to the infant yet knew all the wonderful miracles this child would do. 
He would heal the sick and give hope to the poor. He would give all he had to his people and more. The light of the world, the Savior is here. He will teach us and guide us and he'll have no fear. He will bring us a message, the word from above, and that message is simple, the message of love. Far up in heaven, the joy of Christ rang. The angels were smiling and happy, so sang. Come hear the good news, they said with great joy. Praise our dear Lord and his new baby boy. I celebrate his birthday at Christmas each year, a day that fills people with laughter and cheer. The presents don't matter, but I know it does. My Jesus, my Savior, who will be, is now, and who was. Welcome back. It is now... It's game time. Game time. That's we right. We got microphones. We have microphones. It's pretty sweet. Because we're going to be doing some L Kids karaoke. Karaoke. Finish the lyric edition. Christ Christmas edition. Christmas edition. Christmas. Christmas edition. That's right. Christmas. Christmas. We're yeah. going to get three songs each. We're going to just sing along to the song. It's yes. going to stop. And we have to... Finish, finish the lyric. The lyric, but yeah. we want you to sing along with us. That's right. You know the words. Sing with us. Sing we with may us. not know the words, so we're gonna find out. Do a better job than us. Yes. Okay. Because uh, if you can guess the lyrics yeah. correctly, you get a point. Ooh. If you don't, you don't get a point. Okay. And whoever has the most points at the end is the winner Ooh. of the Christmas. Look at that. This is the winter banana. More winter banana. The winter banana, winter banana. Which means you're gonna get to take this little cutie home with you. Hey. And all right. I think that you should go first because why not? Well, thank you, Pastor Emily. Thank why you. not? Okay. So he's right. going to be singing. We're going to listen along, but we're going to go ahead and put on our handy dandy okay. Okay. headphones. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. They're on. They're on. Are you ready to take take the song away? Why, Pastor Ivalani, I am ready. Ready? All right. Let's cue song number one for Pastor Taylor. Oh, it's a jam. How do you dance? It's a little jazzy. Bells ring. Oh, you're supposed to be singing. Sing it. In the rain, <laughs> snow is glistening. glistening. A beautiful sight. We're happy tonight. Walking in a winter wonderland. I know all the words. And I'm singing them to the kids. Ooh. I'm definitely right. Oh. I'm right now tonight. I don't know the words to the song. Did I nail it? Not even I was, close. I was pretty close. <laughs> Not even close. close. So let's actually hear what the lyrics really were supposed to be. Okay. Cue okay. the song again. Yeah, yeah, bro. I didn't hear you sing about no birds. I didn't sing about any birds. No birds were involved in no your birds. lyrics, but that's okay. That means... What do birds have to do with Christmas, man? <laughs> what is this guy thinking? They'd be flying around. What's well, no right. point for you. No point. So now Fair it's enough. my chance to get a point. Yes. Okay, so yeah. are, you, are we ready? Ready? Song number two? Just jump in for yeah. my first song. Yeah, let's go. Here All right, Evelone. You I... got this. Pass to Evelone. You I... got this. Got to dance first. Christmas. Christmas comes this time each year. Where north, it's cold. This is it. His now red. I don't know where it's. What's up in white? Red. Taking up sled. It's run, run, reindeer. Cause you know, run, run, reindeer. Is that right? Oh, I've been told no. <laughs> I literally thought I knew the words to that song. Ah, you didn't. Because that you was didn't. a jam. I feel like that comes Beast on, Boys, right? and I'm like, I like this song, but I don't know the words. So it's okay. I don't know it's why okay. we're talking in these now. Like we're new. It's because we're, news we're anchors like, now. yeah, news anchors. <laughs> so, and welcome back to Channel Seven, El Kids News. And I did not get a point. So let's hear no what points. this song, the lyric, actually yes. was supposed to be. Hit us. Yep. That's the song. Points for trying. Just kidding. No, no points. Oh, I was like, yeah, sorry. Uh, no points. Okay. That's okay. All right. Well, I guess we're just going to commit to talking in the microphone. Yeah, yeah, we have I to. I like this. We have to. It's a good prop. Okay, so, L Kids, it is now round to number two. It's zero to zero. Mm, 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 zero to zero. Let's change that. Are you ready to I'm ready. try? I'm okay, ready. so Pastor Taylor's going to take another, another sing at it. Get it? Okay. I gave you my heart, but the very next day. You gave it away 
this year I give it to someone special Last Christmas I gave you my heart But the very next day You gave it away That's, I mean, was it the chorus again? Yeah. Yes! That's a classic. That is a classic. When it started, I was like, I wish that was my song. Oh, I know, I was stoked. I was ready I was stoked. to I'm see glad I didn't get the last song. I will say it with you. I'm not gonna lie, I have never heard this song before then. <laughs> like, not one time, so. It's, it's that big of a hit. It's that big, it's okay. that big, it just skipped by me. Elkis, did you yes. know the song with Pastor yes. Taylor? Because he successfully got that right, which means he gets a point. So let's give him <laughs> some Christmas cheer. Boom, he gets a point. Boom. And it is now Boom. my turn. Ready? To go. Ooh. Santa Claus will make this happy by on Christmas Day. I just want you for my own. More than you would ever know. Make my wish come true. All I want for Christmas is you. I don't know what part of the verse we were at in the middle of the... Ah, and I... Ah. <laughs> don't know what part of the song it was I don't think it counts. I don't know if this counts. Because it could have been at many points in the song. Okay, do you feel like that could have been at like it any be, point in the song? It could be a second verse. Could be another chorus. I don't know. That's the challenge. That's the challenge. I we don't know. the challenge. We don't know. That's all right. That's all right. That's all right. All okay. right. The queen of Christmas music Ooh. is very sad about me not <laughs> getting that correct, which is extra sad. But let's actually hear what the lyric was, because I didn't know what part of the song it was at. So we'll to find out, it hit was, it. Yeah, hit it. here. Oh. Yeah, but this is okay. still a jam. Okay. Oh, absolutely. Your... This is how you know Christmas is officially started when this song starts playing. Legend has it, if you sing the lyrics wrong, Mariah Carey will find you. She or will, she will I heard in fall, it's, she defrosts to get she to does. Christmas. That's true. That's true. All right, so we're gonna take a little break and catch you back in just a second. So don't you go, no don't way. go, no, no, uh, no uh, Don't go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Wow, that kid looks like so much fun. Well, hey, L kids, I'm Amanda. Don't you guys just love Christmas? I know I do. It's my favorite time of the year. I love seeing people come together as family and open gifts and eat delicious foods and drinks, just like this hot cocoa. Ooh, seems a little hot. Maybe I'll drink it later. Anyways, Christmas is super fun and all, but we celebrate for one reason, and it's because of Jesus. This time of the year always brings me to a Bible verse that shows that God loves us so much that he sent Jesus to save the world. Let's open our Bibles to 1 John 4.10. It says, this is real love. Not that we love God, but that He loved us and sent us His Son as a sacrifice to take away our sins. What a beautiful verse and what an awesome God. We are truly blessed and loved by the ultimate Father, a Father who wants to spend forever with us in heaven. And this is why He promised us a Savior to make that possible. At the end of the day, we can receive the coolest gifts ever. Nothing compares to Jesus because he was sent on one mission and that was to save the entire world. And he is still doing it to this day because he loves us. Well, El kids, this was super fun. I'm going to get back to drinking my hot cocoa now. I bet it's cooled down by now. Mmm, so good. See you guys next time. Thank you so much and welcome back to game time. Yes. It's round three. It's our final round. Yes. And this round, round is worth one million <gasps> Christmas points. One million <laughs> points. <laughs> Which isn't a lot with inflation nowadays, but it's gonna be okay. It's that's, gonna be all right. That's true. And right. you have one and I have zero. That's right. So that's right. It's your turn. Are you ready Hit me. to sing? Hit me with sing the song. Your heart out. Cue me up. Here we go. Sing along. Ooh, what is this? Ooh, it's soft. It's a bop, but I don't know the words. <laughs> Neither do I. Oh. Oh. 
tonight. Tonight. That was it, right? Tonight. Uh, I mean, I'm not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm right, guys. Yeah, I think it is the word tonight. <laughs> That's about as far I as I like, get, though. Great song. I, that would have been the exact distance <laughs> I would have gone in completing the lyric. So, L kids, let's oh. hear what the lyric actually was. I'm sure it was no longer than that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Makes sense. That's why I lost. All right. Definitely. So, you have a chance to win. Ch chance. You have a chance to win. Chances are low because <laughs> I think I know a song and I don't. He's I gonna play really jingle bells for you. Okay. Are you ready? Are you ready? All right. Okay. I'm ready for my song. Cue the sing. Little Christmas. Oh, well, we just started singing. Let your heart be light. From now on, our troubles will be out of sight. Have yourself. Merry little Christmas. Make the youth a change. Are you sure? From now on, I got it wrong. <laughs> you were on a good start, though. I thought I knew you were off to a good start. Okay, well, let's hear what the lyric was actually Christmas. supposed to be. Okay. Sing it to me. Sing the song. Ooh. Let your heart be light. It's so sweet. It's so sweet. Filled with sadness. Certified so, Christmas banger. Because I got it wrong. Okay, so. That's all right. All right. Uh, that means. Well, we don't know these anymore. And I need to stop yelling. Because I, was, I couldn't hear anything. Headphones, yeah. You're headphones like, get you. That means. So this means that, Pastor Taylor, you are the winner of the Winter Banana. It is quite the honor. It is a Thank brings you. me much joy, Thank Christmas joy. I'm the winter winner? This, you're the winter winner. Oh. The winter winner Man, of the Guess the Lyrics L Kids Karaoke game. Okay, so here you go. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Thank you so and much. And to you out there, if you guess the songs right, you're awesome. I don't know the yeah, words. Yeah, I thought I did, right. but that's that right. was false. You, you know, you probably, you can, you think you know the words because they're on the screen, but play this at home. Oh, yeah. You will have a different experience, all right? Definitely not as easy as it looks. Not. Well, it's not. that is it for game time. We'll catch you back in just a minute. See ya. We're filming. Are we is this thing on? Hello? Is this thing on? Is that, was that a yes? Okay. Hi, I'm the Grinch. The Grinch. And they're paying me to read some burning questions that apparently you ha I am getting paid for this, right? Was that a yes? Okay. So, the first question that is on everybody's mind. Is the Grinch This was not made for a Grinch. I've got hairy fingers. <laughs> ah. It's the Grinch. Naughty or nice? Well, mostly I'm naughty, <laughs> but I'm trying to be nice because Cindy Lou, she wants me to be nice. I don't like it though. Well, maybe a little. Is the cringe? Does this say what I think it does? Help! Thank you. <clears throat> Is the Grinch green? Yes. En Espanol. Si. Verde. Very Verde. You can go to commercial. Is the Grinch a who? Unfortunately. Yes. Yeah. But who is a who anyways? 
I mean, maybe I'm actually a what? A who what? A who what where when why? I'm a, I'm an owl. Stage production, please. Ah, here we go. You want another one? Of course. Is the cringe a good singer? Of course, the Grinch is a good singer. I'm a mean one. I'm Mr. Grinch. I really am. Getting annoyed at this thing being stuck to me. Help, please. There you go. Is the Grinch always eating onions and glass? <laughs> Production. Thank you. Yes, of course. I love it. I've got a spare onion around here. Ah, yeah, tucked away for a rainy day. You're gonna eat that glass? No? Can I have it? Okay. Is the Grinch getting annoyed with taking little pieces of paper off of a paper? Yes! Thank you very much. Is the Grinch finally a fan of Christmas? Well, after I learned the real meaning of Christmas, I began to finally become a fan. But when it's just about presents, that's not for me. The singing, not quite there yet. But the true meaning of Christmas, that I'm a fan of. Well, I wonder how this tastes. Oh yeah, that's pretty good. Well, thank you for joining me for, what's this called again? L-Kids Autocomplete Question. L-Kids Autocomplete Question. Have a Merry Christmas, or don't, I don't care. Where's my onion? Where do you want me to go? Am I supposed to do something now? No, no, come this way. Huh, this over way. here? Uh, this way? Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh! So much Christmas! Alright boys and girls, it is now time for quiz! Today we are focusing on how God has a plan. Are you ready to put your brain to work with a tricky question? Let's find out. Here we go. In our Bible story, how many years before the birth of Jesus did God promise us a Savior? Was it A, 7, B, 70, C, 700, or D, 7,000. You have five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Time's up. Do you have your guess locked in? If you answer D, 7,000, well, that's incorrect. But if you answered C, 700, that is the correct answer. And as our story goes, the promise of our Savior was prophesied in the book of Isaiah 700 years before the arrival of our Savior. God knew we needed saving from his perfect son Jesus to fulfill his perfect plan to save the world. Well, out kids, that's all for today. Thanks for joining me at Quiz Time. Well, today has been really fun and full of Christmas. Full of Christmas. It really has. And not only did we get to play a fun game, mm. but 
We got to hear some awesome Christmas jams. Yes. And even better, we got to hear about God's plan to save the world. You know what, I had fun with that game too, but it made me think. You know, at times we think we know the words to a song, but in reality... We, we don't. We yeah. really don't know the words. Yeah, yeah, we don't. And I would say that's a lot like the story of Jesus' birth. Ooh, yeah. We've heard it and we think we know it. I mean, it's a classic, but do we fully understand it or know the whole story yeah. and the why? behind it. That's good. That's true. And I love how we broke down that why yes. behind our story and how much God loves us. He loves us so much that he made a plan to save all of us through his son, Jesus. Yes. And we all need saving from sin. And Jesus is and will always be the only way yes. to do that. That's right. He came to this world as a baby boy, ultimately to give his life on the cross, to pay the price for sin and be raised from the grave three days later. He did. Mm -hmm. And this was all part of God's plan and yes. his promise to give us a savior. You know, that's the best gift you or anyone could ever receive. Absolutely. So right now we want to invite you to do something really important and that is receive the gift of salvation, be free from sin. Now, if you are out there and you already have a relationship with Jesus, yeah. but you just haven't truly committed to a life that honors him, we want to pray with you as well. So if you're in either of these two groups on the count of three, we want you guys to raise your hand. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. Oh, look at man. that. <laughs> That's really... You guys are making the best decision That's of your amazing. life. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to pray, and I want you to repeat after me. So say it loud and proud. Repeat this prayer. So close your eyes. That's right. Bow your heads. Mm -hmm. No and looking around. Bow your heads. So repeat after me. Dear Heavenly Father, we love you, and we thank you for sending your perfect son, Jesus Christ, to die on the cross for me. I believe in my heart and say with my mouth, you are my Lord. I ask you to forgive me of all my sin. And I thank you for your love and your mercy. We pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. All right, so you know what? We talked about those who have given their life right. to Jesus but are maybe not honoring God and how they live their life. Yeah. Would you please pray with those out there that love that was to. them? When yeah, they hand? absolutely. I would love to. All right, let's keep those heads bowed. Let's keep those eyes closed. This is just a moment between you and God. We don't need to be looking around. So you ready? Dear Heavenly Father, I ask you, to give me the strength to fully commit to your word, to living my life as a follower of Jesus. I thank you that you made a way, despite all my imperfections, that you are perfect. I thank you in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen. And we have Amen. to celebrate with the L Kids Big Five. Of you know course. That. Of we course. Go. Ready? And boom, 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 boom and a boom, 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 boom double and Big a Five. Boom, boom. Whoa, way to go, guys. Oh my goodness. Y'all, <laughs> we are so excited. You have made the best decision today. Um, yeah, I know. And you are kicking off the Christmas season the right oh, yeah. way with Jesus in your life and in your heart. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Well, I am really looking forward to the next chapter in our story. Oh, yeah. me too. Yeah. It's going to be a good one. It is. So, what do you say? Ready? Oh. More hot chocolate? Oh, absolutely. I got you. Uh, I got you. Christmas jams. Oh, Christmas jams. Ready yet? Of course. Cue the music. Of course. Oh, yeah. There it is. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. All right. All right. We All got right. music. But, we got um, music. I think we need some more marshmallows. Listen. Oh. For this very occasion, I keep that thing on me. Okay. In, in your pocket. I got. Yeah, I've got marshmallows. You guys pocket. got marshmallows in your pocket? You guys don't keep marshmallows in your pocket? Well, I mean, it's true. You yeah. never know. You never know when, when you need some, need some marshmallows. Some. Yeah. So come on, bro. Yeah, got Get you. it with it. Okay. Oh, okay. Keep it coming. There you go. There you keep go. it coming. More? Come on. Come More? All the oh, way. Okay. All, All right. the way. We'll see you guys next time. Bye, Elkins. See ya. <laughs>